Hey guys, just wanted to go over 1 Thessalonians chapter 5, verse 9, where it says that God did not appoint us for wrath, but he appointed us for obtaining salvation through Lord Jesus Christ. And it's amazing because we are made in, in the image of God, but it was the sin that separated us um, from God being born into Adam. You were born into sin, and then ever, all of us sinned. So regardless of that, we all still sin and separate from God, but we were not... It says to a point, and the definition is to, it means to fix. That's what the definition of a point is. So you were predestined to know God and to have salvation through God, uh, through Jesus Christ and to know God uh, before the foundations of the earth. And it's amazing because God already knew that uh, we were going to fall, all of us sin regardless anyway. So all of us need a Savior. So that's why you were appointed to, God had fixed it to predestined you to know Christ and have salvation through Christ so it's just amazing so God all the way in from the beginning to the end he knows everything and he knew what we were going to happen but he made a way out for us and Christ freely dying on the cross coming down and shedding his blood nailed the sins to the cross to all that believe in him which is to accept and get uh, repent of their sins will have eternal life and to call upon him will have eternal life and will know the Lord and that's what it's amazing because it says that you were predestined perfectly in the womb and you were called for salvation through Christ. So there's only there's only one way to get to the Father. We know that John chapter 14 verse 6 and it's through Jesus Christ. But all of us have a meaning and a purpose to life and that's finding salvation through the Son, through the Lord uh, Jesus Christ. And it's, a, it's amazing. So we all have a purpose. We all have value. We all have meaning. And we can all find that and know God through Jesus. It's amazing. So we just got to find salvation, especially in these last times. We know we're getting closer obviously to him returning the bible says that if you look up in the sky and you see the clouds you see it darken you know it's going to thunder and it's going to rain it's the same thing that we can look in the uh go to the book of matthew chapter 24 book of luke first book of revelations we know that we're getting closer to the coming of the king so it's important that we need to find salvation and plant seeds and let people know that you know they need to wake up and and repent because the kingdom of god is here and we're not promised another day even if christ doesn't come back in five minutes ten minutes a year or two years it doesn't matter we're not promised another day so it's important that we find the meaning and the value of life and that that true meaning of life is finding salvation and knowing god through jesus christ so it's amazing god bless you guys thank you for tuning in i'll be back shortly definitely with some more scripture